Hey guys, welcome back. So here it is, the final episode of Attack on Titan Season 3, Episode 59, The Other Side of the Wall. Man, I remember when I started my journey diving into Attack on Titan, I was really nervous going in because I didn't really know much about the show. The animation looked kind of disturbing to me, especially all those creepy titans. So I wasn't really keen on checking out the show, but I am so glad that I did. Everyone was absolutely correct. This show is just so rich in storytelling and amazing animation. It's one of the best animes I have ever seen, and I have enjoyed every episode along my epic Attack on Titan journey. So we're finally here at the end of the road, for now, like season four is coming out later this year. But yeah, it's the end of season three, so I don't know when season four is gonna be out, and I don't know when my reactions will be out. I'm really kind of sad that I've I've reached the end, so I have been enjoying just watching Attack on Titan whenever I want, and now I I can't. Well, I can, I still got the the Blu-ray, so I'm gonna definitely rewatch all those things, but damn if it's not incredible. Now the last episode 58 was Attack on Titan where Kruger was talking to Grishal and Kruger mentioned a couple of names, Mikasa and Armin. So straight away we're thinking, how the fuck, what? Why? So I went online and checked out some commentary in an app I use where I kind of log all my TV shows. And I'm not the only one that was like confused as hell. So a lot of hypothesizing is that this guy's actually Aaron from the future. I don't think so. I think memories... They're getting mixed up somehow. I don't know why or what, and we probably won't find out in this episode. But damn if it's just not 100,000 other questions that have been raised. Let's just dive into the episode. Moving forward, there'll be more amazing animes for me to react to, so please stick around if you'd like to see more on my channel. That will come. I don't know what they are yet at this point, but there will be something. Okay, are you ready? Three, two, one, go. The Nine Titans... No matter which era this Titan has found itself in. The Attack Titan. And that's Eren. Because it looked familiar, right? It looks similar to that one. Because he touched her. Because he touched the Royal Titan. Shit. Yeah, they wouldn't need her. That was a really nice ending. Who? Why? What? How? <laughs> oh, straight into it. Is Eren going to be sent back in time? Like 1800 years or whatnot? So each Titan has a, like the Nine Titan has a 13 year lifespan. So you go back far enough, it's like 2000 years. And the very first episode of Attack on Titan was to you 2,000 years in the future or something, right? Am I right? My maths is a bit off right now. But I'm just having synapses. This episode better reveal some shit, I'm telling you. And I do not want it to end on a cliffhanger. Do not. It will, though. There's that bell. I love that bell. Last time. Ah, it's the last step. (sighs) 
This is a penal colony. Con- colony. It's a colony. <laughs> colonoscopy. Penal con- con- colony. God, why can't I say that word? The other side of the wall. Penal colony. I think an Australian could get that right. <laughs> I'm so excited. So they've all had the memories wiped. Domesticated and ignorant. Not cool, bro. Bullshit. Two hundred years, eighteen hundreds. So this is about two thousand. We are the subjects of a mere. You know, they're prospered. Yeah, sitting on oils or something, right? They just want the land. It's all about real estate and resources. Coffee. Yeah, it's a sticky situation. But does that mean everyone in the walls has the ability to turn into a titan? Is it like some kind of latent thing? Hey, Hitch. Yeah. He got stoned. What's with Flock's hair? That thing he has on the on the top.
I'm sure he did. Rude. Ah, oh, bite me. You don't say that to somebody, you fucking asshole. Punch him in the face. Yeah, dick. No. Yes, you are. You're the colossal titan now, man. You're huge. the sea he's had memories again Man, this show's come a long way in the three seasons. Holy crap. Queen Astoria, for God's sake. Crystal. It was hope. It was hope, man. It was hope.
Holy shit. Wow. Didn't play out like we thought it did. How am I supposed to read this? It's going too fast. <laughs> Every time. It's amazing to think there's an entire world out there and these people have just been locked away this whole time. They've been prisoners of a cult their entire life. Essentially. What the fuck? Um, another slug titan? Was it a baby? Was that a baby? Oh, come on, man. They're turning babies into titans. Why would you do that? My chatty can bite you. That's right. All those titans are patriots. They've been killing their own. He's, he's going to attack. I'm just waiting for him to move really fast. No, he's stuck. This is this is so good. They're heading as far as I can go. So those big dumb titans, they they went a long way to get to the wall. Oh, we're here. Holy shit. The sea. The ocean is just up over that rise. This is a big moment. Right here. Wow. God, the animation, man. The ocean and the sky is just artwork. I 
I'm going to go Sasha. Mikasa. The hair's longer. They made it. <laughs> Salt water in the eyes. <laughs> Don't touch it. The shell. What? Oh, she took her shoes off. Wow, this is amazing. It's so beautiful. So much blue. So the continent is on the other side of that. So they ship them over. It's Australia, man. Holy shit. Are we going to try and cross the ocean? Motherfucker! It ended! It's finished! Oh! They saw the ocean! Oh, I've got chills, man, honestly. Like pins and needles and goosebumps. That was stunning. Absolutely gorgeous. I'll listen to this music. Wow. This animation is killing me. It's so good. So many questions not answered still though. To be continued. Yeah, you will. Okay. Damn. Wow. Uh amazing. Amazing. What a show. Um from season one up to this point, it's just, it's just been nothing but joy, honestly. It has terrified me, thrilled me, engrossed me, entertained me, made me laugh, made me cry. Every emotion was touched at some point with this show is just 
stunning and even from day one in that very first season where the animation was a little bit older I mean you can see the transition from season to season how much it got better but even back then season one I was impressed with how gorgeous it was the level of detail they put into the characters into the environments man and the music and the score was just oh so good everything is just um I'm I'm sad now though so we've ended no real answers have come to us since the previous episode. We don't know why Kruger dropped Armin's and Mikasa's name. That's something they'll need to pick up in Season 4. But everyone is there on the shore edge looking at freedom. And as Eren said, their enemies are on the other side. Do they go over there? Do they take the fight to them? Are we going to see a completely different look in Season 4? Are we going to be on the main continent? Oh, it's... There's so much. There's so much to take on board. And like I said, yeah, I've got all the Blu-rays, so a definite rewatch is definitely on the cards. I've been watching the entire series on my little laptop here, so to put it on a big high-definition TV set with the stereo sound is going to be sublime. I can't wait. But holy shit, I've done my first run-through, my first watch of Attack on Titan. Thank you so much for joining me on this journey. It's been amazing. And yeah, it's a damn shame. I had to turn the comments off. The spoilers were coming at me thick and fast, and... For the most part, I went in blind on every episode, but there were some things that were dropped on me that I, I just can't forgive you for. You son of a bitch. Whoever you are who's just dropping these things, you spoiled it for everyone. But anyway, that's done. That's dusted. We're all moving forward. Now I'm up to date with the show. Moving forward with the manga. I don't know. I'm going to read it and I'll stop before the show starts because I want to let the show just surprise me. And that's what it does constantly. It's just... So good. I'm so glad I watched it. Oh, man. What next? More anime reactions, that's for sure. I'm going to dive into a new show. I'll figure something out, but hopefully it'll be something that entices you to come over and watch. Death Note, potentially. Tokyo Ghoul. Who knows? Steins Gate. There's amazing content out there, so keep watch. I'll surprise you all. But anyway, until Attack on Titan returns, see you then.